and submit ourselves to God if we are to enter the kingdom of heaven, if we are to enter God's kingdom, where he says that there's going to be no more death, no more dying, no more diseases, that God will wipe away every tear from our eyes. And he says that he's going to make all things new, all things beautiful. And he's, but he says that those that are outside the kingdom, those that are still walking in the ways that are not pleasing to God, are not going to make it into that kingdom. They're not going to. They're going to miss out on the salvation of their soul. And that's why we're here to declare today that today is the day of salvation. That Jesus said, He says. Come unto me, all you who labor and are heavily laden, and I will give you rest. See, Jesus is the Prince of Peace. He is the only way to receive rest. He is the only way to receive a spiritual life where you can start to praise God and you can start to worship God in the Spirit and actually receive a prayer life. See, every single time you try to pray or speak to God without the Spirit of God, all this is in vain. You cannot... You can, God will not hear you. He does not... He does not uh, hear the prayers of sinners. But he says a faithful, and I can't remember exactly, prayer righteous man God will not despise. And that's why you must know, people of the world, that there's people in the church today that are praying for your souls, that you might receive this word that we are preaching today and every other day that we come out to preach it, and not just us, but other people in the kingdom. And see, Jesus said that he's going to build his church upon this rock and the gates of hell shall not prevail. So that's why we're inviting you to the kingdom that God is calling you unto himself. That you might receive the love of the truth and be saved. That you might realize that it's not going to profit you to gain this whole world and to lose your own soul. There is a world out there. The world is darkness. The world is a kingdom and it's Satan's kingdom. And we're calling you today to come out of the world. To come to the kingdom of God. Jesus said, go out and tell them. Repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. The kingdom, as, as this young guy was telling us, the kingdom of God does not exist. You cannot see it unless you have become born again and see you're born in the flesh one time born in sin shaped in iniquity but to see the kingdom of heaven to be born you must be born again you can't see your spiritual eyes are closed to the truth of the gospel the bible says that you're dead in your transgressions and sins walking according to the course of this world that's why you need to come out of it come out from among them and be separate says the lord and he will receive you and he will lift you up in high places seated in Christ Jesus. God wants to lift you up. He knows you.